New tonight, moving from inside restaurants to a mobile walk-up window. It's a new option that some restaurants are turning new in order to cook up new business. And it is working. WBZ's Rachel Holt shows us the new focus on food trucks. With more and more people going outside, so are business owners banking on food trucks to have a big spring and summer. With the pandemic situation, what it was, we thought let's let's try to let's try to broaden our horizons and do something different that we've never done before. Summer Shack, which has been in business for over 20 years, launched their first ever food truck on April 16th. You don't have to put down tables six feet apart from each other. Um, there's but but by the nature of the truck being what it is, like we're going to be a lot more distance from the people coming in. But that's uh, a nice change of pace from from having to worry about stuff like that in a restaurant. People are coming out of their homes and seeing uh, food trucks as another dining option, a safe dining option, and we're getting new food trucks every day as well, since food trucks are also feeling the optimism. Natalie LaCorpse and Karen Glamaud were deciding between a brick and mortar or a food truck for their new venture, Gourmet Creole. Ultimately, choosing a restaurant on wheels. Definitely the right choice. Definitely because I know uh, because of COVID, everything that's going on with the restaurants and the capacity of people that they can have in their restaurant is, you know, it's really low. Gourmet Creole launched this week with plans to spend Thursdays in Jamaica Plain and Fridays in the South End. But already, due to the turnout, they're thinking of ramping up business. This is amazing. God is so good. I'm so happy. I'm grateful. We're probably going to add a couple of more days. There's just kind of, for me, like a lift in the air, and I'm excited to just be able to eat outdoors and enjoy the weather, the good company, and good food. For WBZ News, I'm Rachel Holt.